All right, all right, ladies, gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, we are back with murder on Eridanos. Let's check out what's in here. Is this just a balcony? Oh, is it? There's a door. Never mind, it is just a balcony. So just out to the orchards we go. I don't see it. Oh, that smell! Whatever that is, it'll kill more than bacteria. Hmm. Oh, you're that inspector, right? Uh, sorry, but the pool's currently closed on account of it stinking worse than my boss. <laughs> hmm. What can I do for you? What is that smell? Uh, yeah, it's part of the job. I think I'm listed as a security consultant. But all that really means is that if I'm caught without this thing, I get put on pool guard duty. I don't know what happens if I'm caught without it on pool guard duty, but I know that I don't want to find out. Hmm. Okay. Space me if I knew. I got here from my shift this morning and found it this way. They can't yell at me for this one, which is good, because a lot of folks seem upset by it. Uh, so it happened just before the brown launch? Part of the reception for the Spectrum Brown launch was supposed to be out here. Rizzo's rented out the area, said they had their own maintenance person instead of paying one of slugs. As you can see, their maintenance person ruined the use of the pool for everyone. Would have been even worse if the unveiling hadn't been cancelled. Can't do much now but wait for the stench to wear off. We found the individual hired to clean face down in a puddle of his own spit in the orchards. Guess he won't be helping. I see. Something sounds off kilter. I'd like to take a look around. Face down in his own spit. Uh, very interesting, but I've got more important things to investigate. It sounds like it might be connected, actually. Uh, all right. You may want to visit the sun parlor. That's where that Rizzo's fool mixed the chemicals he used. Oh, and you can talk to Lily, my boss. She probably has some great advice. I saw her walk toward the bridge to the Purpleberry Orchards earlier. Reckon she's still there. Now, uh, anything else I can do for you? Uh... No. Hi again! It's like I just saw ya. Pool's still closed, unfortunately. Yeah, I got some questions. So long as you don't want to go in, I can answer anything you like. Yep, still dead. Usually Rizzo's is pretty good at making sure the people they hire ain't got tripacale for brains, but that fella clearly wasn't worth trusting. I met him briefly once. Seemed level-headed enough, but that must have been just a front. Otherwise, he wouldn't have made such a mess of things. Right. Sounds good to me. Again. Okay, never mind. Oh wait. So long as you don't want to go in, I can. Hell no, it ain't normal. Law Almighty, that's a screw up like none I ever seen. Almost seems foolish enough. It must have been done on purpose. Yeah. Sounds good to me. Was that sun parlor? Hmm. 
I don't see anything else, so let's go back in. Where is that? All the way over there, huh? Okay. Oh, it's a whole separate building. What the hell was that? Oh my god. Anybody bring raptodons up here? Don't this hotel have a policy on animals? Oh my god. Whew. Thanks for the help back there. I've uh, actually never fired a gun before. Is this ringing in your ears normal? Yeah, tinnitus. Hmm, that's more than a little disconcerting. Since I maxed out my medical allotment this month. That's what I call my booze fund. Still... I had to be alive to be able to go deaf later. I'm not sure if I actually hit any shots. If you hadn't intervened, it could have been bleak. Well, you're welcome. Uh, seems like slug, seems, seems like it'd be slug's job to keep all the raptodons from getting this far. You know, I just realized you owe me a little more than a thanks. What do you mean? Oh. You know, they warned me about freelancers, but I forgot what they said. Also, who they were. Anyway, here. I'm just as confused as you are. Someone should have been on shift to see them coming. Ms. Vargas would probably have a better idea of what happened. She's stationed at the luxury pad. Okay. We'll investigate that later. All right. Blue water cooling uh, coloring. Add the chemical to the pool filter. Investigate the pool. Speak to somebody. Speak to the mysterious note writer. Up to the balcony we go. Not that way. No, where's the balcony door? Am I able to just come up this ramp and go around? Oh shit, okay. A 
I saw you meander on out of the pool and into the greenhouse. Now you're here, does that mean what I think it means? Might mean that you can be trusted. Might not. Guess we'll see. Alright, um... Seems like easy uh, money I'm in. What's in it for me? Why go after the hotel pool? Not exactly a high-profile target. Eh, maybe not. Maybe I just want Rizzo's working relationship with Slug to implode for the benefit of Spacer's choice. But you're right. It ain't high-profile. And it ain't gotta be. Any damage to Rizzo's is cause for celebration. You ain't gotta concern yourself with my spite. Consider me an average Byzantine, and I'll consider you an average contractor. Hmph. <laughs> Shame. Well, I hope you'll soon see Rizzo's for what they are, and help me bring them low. Eh, they're paying me right now. Plus, eh, I think it's more fun to just tell the guard. <laughs> Hi again. It's like I just saw. So long as you. I can't tell him. So what is that? Is that the? Oh, that's the filter. They already don't like me. Oh, I gotta talk to him again? Cool's nothing but an acrid mess of concrete, I hear. Hope I'll hear the sound of Rizzo's heads hitting the floor next. Uh, usually when I wreck something, I'm the one who gets in trouble. Feels good. Glad you got something out of it. All I ever feel is a dull ache in my chest. Here's your pay. Spacer's Choice thanks you for your contributions to future profits. Okay, maybe I should have read, read fully because I thought I was just cleaning the pool. <laughs> So, let's go to the orchard, keep pursuing that other lead, wait, am I going the right way? No, I'm not. Rizzo's Purpleberry Fudge, a salt flower candy shop, purpleberry flavor In the middle of a lockdown, no one's supposed to be coming or going. And when I can't get a hold of anyone in the orchards, I can't make sure of that, can I? No, Miss Vargas. I swear to the architect, Matthias, if you've lost your rifle's ionization coil again. Oh, wait, you ain't part of my crew. What do you want? A few things. Are you okay to sound tightly wound? Who's Matthias? Pool guard told me to talk to you. Oh, thank the law you're here about the pool. That crucial thing that isn't my job to fix. And that, as such, I don't care about. If you want advice, here it is. Don't talk to that imbecile ever again. Even by my crew standards, he's duller than a telescoping staff. And he's not even one of my worst problems. I got landing pad lockdowns, gate closures, angry guests, and now one of my crew is AWOL. Missing person? Uh, I'm actually an inspector and I could take a look at that for you. If you're serious, I'd appreciate the help. He's been missing a few days. And we're low on staff as it is. I'll look. I'll look into it. What I need to know. A few days. Uh, why do you wait till now and until uh, now to search for him? It's not exactly uncommon for slug agents to go on the odd bender. They'll pick a place they think I don't know about and hunker down. Usually, I don't bother with the discipline and paperwork. Got to pick your battles. Thing is, they usually resurface within 24 hours, or at least yell for medical help. Ah. This guy, not a peep. Hmm. Alright, I'll look into it. The missing crew member's Evan O'Connell. 
He's one of about two slug agents I can trust with more complex tasks than stand here and look tough. Friendly type. Well behaved, followed orders. Anyone else, I'd think they got drunk and fell asleep in a ditch somewhere, but O'Connell's not really the type. He was last stationed at the Wilderness Checkpoint. I'd search there first. All right. There's the orchards. Let me check to see where this, uh, where that is. Over there. Hmm. No, well, let's do that. I hope the murderer. We got to uh, a site mission out of the way quickly anyway, so we can investigate this one too. Plus, it's not like the murder is going anywhere. I'm pretty sure they locked down all the airspace. Another way through. On the roof, maybe. <laughs> okay, so they were playing cards, botanical operations. Is that just a building surrounded by hedges? Please don't tell me it's a maze. Okay. Oh, thank God. Someone has scratched the name and replaced it with Evan O'Connor. Oh, oh, no, I don't need to go back in the hotel. At least I don't think so. I was going in in the first place. Is that the orchard, maybe? I don't know. Oh, it looks like it. So I'm heading in the right direction anyway. This house is not too loud.
Where's the last one? Just kind of had a feeling. Timeline discrepancy detected nearby. Okay, I'll take a look. The garb on this security guard identifies him as a member of the Rizzo's corporation. His rank would have been that of jawbreaker or higher. This security guard has experienced premature expiration. Evidence strongly suggests a conflict with marauders. Search his pockets. Well, he if he's part of the crew, right, he might be involved in something that happened here. Uh, found three bits, okay. At least he gave his life for a worthy cause. Just a bunch of weapons sitting around? Discrepancy detected nearby. Oh, wow, really? Hello. This card also expired prematurely following a violent encounter with Marauders. Okay, well, let's take a look in here. Timeline discrepancy detected nearby. Dear God, where? gotten into the spectrum in these crates listen to this come out come out to play wow he's having a grand old time i'm gonna take him to a2 under the hotel so he can sleep it off i'll meet you back at the orchard straight after see you soon evan come on you slackwit okay so she took him somewhere else under the hotel. Let's take a look. Oh my god, what am I stuck on the bar? And she said it was under the hotel, so we probably need to figure out a good way to find a staircase or an elevator. Rizzo's who gets it if you hit it over the edge. Right right, back in we go. Okay. Black Hole Bertie. I just realized I think I might be playing under a different save than I was with the game. I don't think so, because I. It said, like, what? 25. 25th of something. How awful. Here we go. Oh, you're the inspector. Welcome. Has anyone helped you with your luggage yet? Get anything good for lunch? Pea free nut butter and jelly free. There are enemies down here. You were 
hear about the murder? I can't imagine what it must be like. Living down here like sprats in a wall. A2. Timeline discrepancy detected nearby. Inspector, I've detected a structural anomaly within a 0.8 meter radius of this locked door. Uh, does the door have a weak point? I could try to smash it. This floor panel is 0.3 millimeters shorter than regulation length, suggesting unauthorized modification. They got the drop on us. Get our hands dirty. Huh. Thunder clap? A key to B1. I need a key to B2. They've been stealing from the uh, hotel. Getting into <sighs> maybe from A one. What the hell is this? There's no like hidden anything I can use to, okay. I got that. Bellhop. 
That didn't hit it, did it? Wait, that's a oh engineers. Okay. That didn't help. I need to find a way into that. God damn room. Notice that. Okay, there's a janitor's closet right there. Hold on. Still nothing? just can't get in there, huh? Hey, Bravati. I can't believe Miss Helen's gone. It feels like it's going against the laws of nature somehow. I used to watch Helen's serials. She'd fall into mortal peril every couple episodes, but she always lived in the end. Uh, I'm glad I could take you to see. Okay, how, how do you feel? Breathtaking. Have you looked over the edge of the complex yet? Just watch the clouds turning? It's like an ocean without end. Eridanos and Olympus are the two biggest planets in Halcyon. King and queen of the sky. Looking out to the horizon, I get this feeling that we're in the company of royalty. Eridanos is a hundred times the mass of Terra 2, eight hundred times the volume, ten times the diameter. We're flying through the tiniest layer of habitable atmosphere. Sometimes I can't believe how small my world used to be. My horizons were about as wide as the walls of Edgewater. Aww. I'm glad we got you off of Edge, out of Edgewater, and now look at you, top of the world. Yeah. <laughs> We've come a long way. All right, I thought uh, thought I was gonna be able to convince her to smash through that door. Ah, damn it! Maybe I can go ask the concierge or check in here. Okay, well, that was a bust. I was a few minutes late with room service earlier today. Guest I was trying to serve shot at me with a revolver. Oh my god. I left the drink and ran. Uh. Oh, you're the inspector. Welcome. Has anyone helped you with... Sublight Underground appreciates your patronage. No, okay. Wow, I haven't felt this great in ages. I wonder what happened. 
Sublight Underground appreciates your patronage. Never mind. Am I missing something? Now let's go see about the concierge and ask her. Wait, I'm getting turned around. Where are the stairs? No, I'm sorry. We don't serve any drinks at those three nights. Hello. The Grand Colonial Front Desk warmly welcomes you, Inspector. It's a pleasure to see you again. How may I be of assistance to you, Inspector? Oh, my. Well, that is certainly odd and alarmingly unacceptable. Allow me to check the service records. Ah, yes. Not to worry, Inspector. It was indeed cleaned for you. Except for the evidence, which is all of Helen's stuff. Okay. And there is no, literally no option about that room downstairs. Okay, so I'll figure it out when, and uh, when we return, we'll, we'll see what happens. Thank you so much, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, for joining me. Um, when we return, we're going to see what up, what's up with that side mission, probably go to the orchards and have a little fun. So I thank you so much for watching. If you're on YouTube, please like, comment, subscribe on Twitch. Drop me a follow if you haven't already, and I will be back tomorrow. Mm -hmm.